हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू आवर चैनल लर्निंग नोटबुक आज यू नो सीबीएसई हैज इशूड गाइडलाइंस टू प्रमोट आर्ट इंटीग्रेटेड एजुकेशन एंड टू मेक स्टूडेंट्स अवेयर अबाउट द वास्ट एंड डाइवर्स कल्चरल हेरिटेज ऑफ आवर कंट्री इंडिया सो टुडे इन दिस वीडियो वी विल लर्न अबाउट स्टेट महाराष्ट्र एंड यू विल फाइंड lot of ideas on how to create art integrated project on maharashtra aim of this art integrated project is to understand the people culture history population geography climate dances dresses food religious places heritage sites and other famous places to visit in maharashtra Maharashtra is a state in the western peninsular region occupying a substantial portion of the Deccan Plateau. It is the third largest state by area in India. The capital of Maharashtra is Mumbai, which is the most populous urban area in India. Now let's learn about history of Maharashtra. If you are enjoying watching videos on our channel then do like, share and comment on our videos. Also do not forget to subscribe to our channel Learning Notebook. students we have animated mathematics videos from class 1 to class 10 on our channel learning notebook so do visit our channel Next is geography of Maharashtra
Next is climate of Maharashtra. Now let's see population of Maharashtra. If you are enjoying watching videos on our channel, then do like, share and comment on our videos. Also, do not forget to subscribe to our channel Learning Notebook. Next topic is Languages of Maharashtra. Now let's see people and culture of Maharashtra. We have animated mathematics videos from class 1 to class 10 on our channel Learning Notebook. So do visit our channel.
Now let's learn about famous places to visit in Maharashtra. If you are enjoying watching videos on our channel, then do like, share and comment on our videos. Also, do not forget to subscribe to our channel Learning Notebook. The first famous place of Maharashtra is Mumbai, which is the capital of Maharashtra. Mumbai is a spectacular paradox of chaos, hope, glamour, modernity and tradition. Famously known as City of Dreams, Mumbai is a melting pot of cultures and lifestyles. The second famous place of Maharashtra is Mahabaleshwar. It is a hill station located in the Western Ghats. Apart from its strawberries, Mahabaleshwar is also well known for its numerous rivers, magnificent cascades and majestic peaks. Let's see the third place which is Panchgani. Deriving its name from the five hills surrounding it, Panchgani is a popular hill station near Mahabaleshwar. It is famous for its various sunset and sunrise points and scenic valley views. Let's see the next place which is Lavasa. Lavasa is a perfect blend of beauty and infrastructure. It is India's first planned hill city located near Pune in Maharashtra. Next place is Rajmachi. Rajmachi is a small village situated in the Shaitri mountain range of the Konkan region of Maharashtra. Next famous places of Maharashtra are Lunavla and Khandala. These are the famous twin hill stations in Maharashtra and the place to be during monsoon. Last famous place of Maharashtra is Pune. Often referred to as Oxford of the East, Pune is a hub of diverse people and activities and is rapidly growing into one of the top metropolitan cities in the country. Now let's learn about famous religious places to visit in Maharashtra. The first religious place of Maharashtra is Shirdi. The home of great saint Sai Baba, Shirdi is a religious site close to Nasik with various temples apart from the famous Sai Baba temple. Shirdi holds a strong importance as a holy and pilgrim place by Sai Baba devotees. Next famous religious place of Maharashtra is Siddhi Vinayak Temple. It's a Hindu temple dedicated to Lord Sri Ganesh. It is one of the richest temples in India. Let's see the next religious place of Maharashtra which is Nasik. Located on the banks of river Udabri, Nasik is one of the best tourist places in Maharashtra. This city has number of ancient temples and most importantly it is known for being host to the holy Kumbh Mela once in every 12 years. Next religious place is Kolapur. Kolapur derives its name from a mythological story of Kolasul, a demon which was slain by goddess Mahalakshmi. Kolapur is famous for Mahalakshmi Temple. It is also known for 
colorful sandals and necklaces that are sold worldwide. Next place is Grineshwar Jyotirling Temple. Being dedicated to Lord Shiva, this temple is home to one of the Jyotirlings mentioned in the Shiv Puran. Let's see the next religious place which is Aurangabad. Aurangabad is the tourism capital of Maharashtra. This town is used as the base to explore the extremely famous caves of Ajanta and Elora and Dalatabad Fort. The last religious place of Maharashtra is Trimbakeshwar Jyotirling. Located in Nasik, this temple in Maharashtra is dedicated to Lord Shiva. The Jyotirling here depicts three faces that is, Lord Brahma, Lord Vishnu, and Lord Rudra. Now let's learn about heritage sites to visit in Maharashtra. If you are enjoying watching videos on our channel, then do like, share and comment on our videos. Also, do not forget to subscribe to our channel Learning Notebook. The first heritage site of Maharashtra is Ajinta and Elora Caves. Ajinta and Elora Caves, UNESCO World Heritage Site, are the ancient rock cut caves located near Aurangabad. Ajinta and Elora Caves Complex is adorned with beautiful sculptures, paintings, frescoes and includes Buddhist monasteries, Hindu and Jain temples. Next heritage place of Maharashtra is Chhatrapati Shivaji Terminus. It was formerly known as Victoria Terminus. This marvelous structure is the perfect example of the Victorian Gothic style of architecture in India. It was built in 1878 and it is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Next place is Elephanta Caves. A UNESCO World Heritage Site, Elephanta Caves is a specimen of rock cut art and architecture from the times of medieval India. This collection of cave temple dates back to 5th to 7th centuries and most of them are dedicated to Lord Shiva. Next heritage site of Maharashtra is Gateway of India. This imposing monument is a beautiful confluence of Indian, Arabic and Western architecture. It is also the starting point of a number of ferry services that fly to the historic Elephanta Caves. Next heritage site of Maharashtra is Jagar Fort. It is also known as the Fort of Victory. It is a 16th century fort that extends over an area of 13 acres in the coastal region of Ratnagiri in Maharashtra. The last heritage site of Maharashtra is Pratapgarh Fort. This fort is also known as Willow Fort and is famous for the battle of Pratapgarh. Pratapgarh Fort is a mountain fort built by great King Chhatrapati Shivaji. Now let's learn about famous traditional dances of Maharashtra. If you are enjoying watching videos on our channel, then do like, share and comment on our videos. Also, do not forget to subscribe to our channel Learning Notebook. 
फेमस डांसर्स ऑफ महाराष्ट्र आर लावनी तमाशा कोली डांस डिंडी डांस And the last dance form is Dhangari Gaja. Next is traditional festivals of Maharashtra. First traditional festival of Maharashtra is Ganesh Chaturthi. Next is Gudi Pal or the Marathi New Year. After that, it is Gokul Ashtami or Janmashtami. Next festival of Maharashtra is Makar Sankranti. Let's see the next festival which is Pola. And the last traditional festival of Maharashtra is Elora festival. Now let's see traditional food items of Maharashtra. If you are enjoying watching videos on our channel then do like, share and comment on our videos. Also do not forget to subscribe to our channel Learning Notebook. First is pav bhaji. Next is vada pav. then puran poli after that it is misal pav next food item is modak shrikhand
Poha. भेलपुरी एंड द लास्ट फूड आइटम इज कड़ी Now let's see traditional dresses of Maharashtra. The men in Maharashtra usually wear dhoti and kurta. and women in maharashtra wear sarees So this was all about Maharashtra. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye bye.